Alright guys, we're back in this Kerr Stadium where we got the worst call in officiating history. I'm going to show you guys what a ball inbounds looks like. This ball might look out of bounds. As you can see, in bounds. <laughs> Let's, go! Let's go, baby! What's up guys? We're finally back. I know I took a little bit of time off YouTube, but it was for all good reason. I had to focus on the season, establish myself into the team before I went and started filming things. And even then, it still took me kind of a long time. The video you're about to see is a culmination of clips that I uh, recorded over the last couple months to give you guys a week in the life of what it's like. But we got it, and I'm excited to show you guys. So this is a week in the life of an NFL player. Let's get it. That's the fit, guys. Just some sweats. Team Claypool merch. Yep, that's it. So let's go to the facility. Uh, this is my drive to work. Yesterday, usually I would have went in and lifted and I would have brought you guys with me then, but our building was shut down and we had to get everyone tested and make sure no one had it. So now everything really just got pushed back a day. So I'm going to get tested today and then go lift today. Yeah, so it is Tuesday, but uh, back to the drive. We got testing, lifting, maybe grab a bite to eat, and then that might be it. We also have election day today, so that'll be interesting. I can't vote, I'm sorry guys. Uh, this one's on you. And now I just gotta go get tested in this cabin right here. Here we go. Hey Chase, last name and date of birth? July 798, Claypool. Thank you very much. Good. All Is that right. you? Good, yeah. All right, have a great day. Perfect, guys. thank you. See you tomorrow. Have a good day, guys. We do that every day, guys. Every single day. Now we're heading in to the uh, slit tape. Lift. Now I gotta open whatever got sent to me. This is from Adidas. We got some cakes. Ooh, she's kind of drippy. I'm actually, not signed to a shoe deal, so thank you, Adidas, for sending some love. I mean, that will certainly help with the deadline. Here's your light. I got some fluid in my knee. It might be, uh, might require surgery or amputation. Are you serious? I mean, not about the um, surgery, but maybe about the amputation. This is where it goes down. This is serving lines right here. Spike ball gets real. You guys are gonna see tomorrow. It gets real, it gets heated. It's always me and Ed Al versus Duck and James Washington. It is a close series, but through kind of grit, film study, I guess trust in one another, me and Al are slowly pulling away, so. Hey, we vlogging, baby. I'm gonna get the good shower too. Let's go. This is the shower room. This is the best shower in the building. Everyone knows that. Let's go. All right, guys, that concludes my shower. Um, we're gonna go ahead and check out what Deontay's doing. Uh, oh my God. <laughs> we Tay TikToking. Tay just pointed this out to me. We got our new face mask on the helmet. That's beat. Who is your favorite athletic trainer in the NFL? <laughs> some people call him Wig. Some people call him Wiggy Wig. Just it's depends. Exactly. We would sandwich it like this. It works for me. Put your seat back a little bit in your Tesla. I'm gonna have the biggest leg in North America right now. All right, if you get on this wall, we change these on Wednesday. 
So if you get on the wall, that means you made a splash play. The big pictures are like uh, game changing plays. And then this is like all the important plays in the game. And in that game, I had uh, one reception, negative two yards. So safe to say I'm not on the wall. That was a touchdown. This one must have been a fourth down stop or third down stop. So I'm not on there this time, but maybe for the Ravens week, I'll make it on the wall. We'll see. Cafeteria. Hello. We got the smoothie station here. I'm gonna get strawberry spinach. Ooh, I'll get ice. I'll get a banana. As I was walking out, I saw my son here, Anthony Johnson. I'm gonna go back, back. <laughs> okay, that's enough of that. All right, that concludes my vlogging day for this Tuesday at the facility. Cause what I usually do is just go back, play games. So that's probably what I'll do. But uh, it's Tuesday. All right, guys, I'm out of here. Let's go. What's up, guys? We just got done with practice. Usually we play a little spike ball after practice, but with the new COVID protocols that we're going through, we are not able to do that. We do this little Zoom call right here on the iPad. We sit on the chair, answer some questions. That's what I do after practice. We just got done with practice, just got done with media. Now we got post-practice <laughs> meetings, got lunch, and then back home. And we're gonna be going to dinner with some teammates. So uh, should be should be a eventful day and I'll bring you guys with me. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know how many reps I did, but it felt about right. Seventy three is not bad. It is not bad. We can work with seventy three. To keep the weight light, we do the blocks right there. So there's no pec injuries, but it still gets the muscle working and it still gets me out of breath. So. All right, and that is basically the workout. I gotta do the bench one more time, gotta do the lat pull down one more time, and then that's the workout. And I'm kinda tired, getting a little working. Uh, it doesn't look pretty, but it was smacking. The boys got together, got something to eat, and we're done for the day. Clamp it loud. All right, y'all, we just finished practice. Let's finish lift. We got my son AJ in the tub here. AJ, say what's up to YouTube. How y'all doing? So now we better hop in the cold tub. I didn't mean to thirst trap like that, but uh, that's what we're doing. And then we're probably gonna end in the hot tub. We're about to go like, damn, Chase walking. Probably like eight minutes in here and then like two minutes in the hot tub just so I can walk around, move. But that's what we do, it's Thursday. Basically the same thing that we did yesterday. So the only thing different is the cold tub that I like to do on Thursdays because Thursdays kind of picks up on intensity. So uh, doing this, eight minutes here, two minutes, and then just back to the crib, we out. That is another day. I didn't show too much today on Thursday because it's like basically the exact same thing as Wednesday. Lift, um, the only thing different is the cold tub that I like to do. And then tomorrow we got a short day. And then I think I got a massage tomorrow. So I'll show you guys kind of what that looks like. Saturday, that's when we travel. So I'm excited. Let's get it. Let's get it. All right, guys, we just finished Friday practice. It is 12.30. Usually we play spike ball, but that boy Al just had a kid. So no spike ball today. Um, I'll insert some clips of last Friday and what we usually do. I got a massage later today. I got an interview with Jerome Bettis today. Um, so I'll give you guys a behind the scenes look. And then uh, that wraps up the day for Friday, man. And uh, Pouncey's gonna go ahead and sign us off. No one cares, Chase, <laughs> let it go. And uh, that's it. Before we leave on this fine Friday, as you guys can see from the background, we did not make it on the wall. We made it right there in the little pictures, but uh, we did not make it on the wall. Just laying up there. And then we got uh, mink right there. So we didn't make it, man. But next week, hopefully, uh, we can get on that wall. We got to make a big play. This might be one of the most legendary picks of all time. Good boy. Good stuff, man. Keep it up.
Ah, we'll get it next time. We'll get it next time. We have a Pepsi round table talk with all the rookies. As you saw, you saw Mike send it up. He does video stuff for some of the guys in our team. So he came over, helped me set up the camera. As you just saw, I just got finished with my massage. I do that before every game, either the day before I travel or the day before the game. And now I am gonna go get something to eat, probably a noodle head, and that would wrap up my Friday. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> we just got done with our Saturday walkthrough before the game. And uh, now we, uh, we did all the necessary business that we had to take care of. Next step is to drive to the flight and uh, travel to Dallas and then beat the Cowboys. Let's go. So that's a Rolls Royce right there. You got a Mercedes up there that just turned. And then what do you got there? You got some nice whip right here. So it's literally a car show. Uh, and then everyone stops and like takes pictures or looks at it or something. So come on, make this it's kick. Right <laughs> make this kick, please. Jonathan Gore is hard beating fast. Kicker for the extra point to tie the game at 33. I know we just fast forwarded to me in the hotel room watching the Irish boys dub the Clemson boys. It was so hype. I took my shirt off because I was sweating. Um, man, I'm at a loss of words. I'm hyped, man. I'm asleep like a little baby. Irish on top. Let's go. All right, y'all. We are in this massive resort and I am going down to get tested right now. So I need to put on my little disguise so I have to walk kind of kind of far and uh, hopefully I don't get recognized so I don't get the Rona. So yeah, this, this place is crazy. We were here for the uh, Nerd and Clemson game, the team that we just waxed last night. Easy dub. Check it out, check it out. Not bad. Sport. right before the game, 10 minutes till kickoff. Let's go. All right, guys, that's a wrap. Uh, we want to close one. Uh, wasn't pretty, but we got the job done. Now, uh, we just get ready, head right to the bus, and we're out of here. 8-0, uh, you know, lots to learn from, but the, the grind continues. I'm never sliding again, ever. Courtesy of my dude, Chase, appreciate you. All right, man, we're out of here. Say, be home 12:30, and we out. Uh, got COVID tests in the morning. Other than that, though, good dub, eight no. Keep pushing, keep grinding, and uh, we build from this. And uh, we're back at the crib in the bed. Uh, all's well, man. It is 12:30, uh, and I'm about to crash. Better go to sleep. I uh, need to get treatment tomorrow because I'm beat up. But uh, appreciate y'all watching the vlog, man. Claypool. Oh.